Okay, so today I'm going to be giving a demonstration of the 48 volt 50, excuse me, 48 volt 72 volt universal battery profile for the BAC controller. So here I have a ASI BAC 800 hooked up to 72 volt LiPo battery and a Bafang BBS HD. Got the backdoor software hooked up to it. You can see right here. Battery voltage is 79 volts. Also data logging motor RPM. So we're just gonna give it, a couple, give it some throttle right now and take a look at the motor RPM. about 13,000 RPM at 79 volts. Just to give you an idea how impressive the performance is. So right now, we're going to swap out the battery to a 52 volt battery. And then I'll show you guys how it will run. So let me disconnect from this right here. Zoom out to show you guys what's going on. Okay, so I turned off the battery. Excuse me, not battery, uh, controller. Unplug it right now. So this is my LiPo harness. I'm gonna reconfigure this battery for 52 volts. So I remove two packs from the series harness here. I'm gonna plug in my 2S pack. So. So right now, three 4S packs, that's 12S plus 2S, that's 14S, which is, as you know, is 52 volts. Plug in my jumper right here. Okay, just double checking, everything's good. I'm gonna plug in my battery now. 52 volts, nominal. Okay, connected now. Turn on the controller now. Yep, as you can see, red LED is on. All right, let's reconnect here. I have to relaunch backdoor. It's an old laptop, so it's not very stable. But just bear with me right now. Yeah, I used to work in IT, so this is all kind of second nature to me. All right, back door has been reopened, connected now. I don't know if you can see the parameters here. All right. So as you can see here, let me zoom in, 55 volts. I didn't change any parameters or anything like that. All I did was just swap the battery. All right. Let's give it some throttle right now. crazy on 52 volts as 72 volts but you can see at 55 volts motor rpm still climbs to a little over 10,000 rpm close to let's say 10,000 and a half 10,500 rpm which is not bad which is still a significant jump 
from the stock BBS HD internal controller, which is about 3000 RPM. So you're getting roughly three and a half times more RPM. So that's all I have for today. Thanks guys.